Hello friends, in today's video we're going to be dealing with this uh, Honda Jazz. This particular model is 2004. The issue is uh, with the, the transmission uh, sensor. So basically this car is automatic uh, and uh, when, we, when you put it in drive mode, the car doesn't go forward. The only thing works at the moment is uh, just the reverse gear. So whenever you put it in uh, D mode, the car will not drive until uh, the engine is fully warmed up which uh, takes about 10 minutes and uh, when you put it into drive mode the drive mode light flashes on the dash we did a diagnostic and uh, it came up in the diagnostic that it is the transmission speed sensor which is faulty so the location of uh, transmission speed sensor is uh, under there just under the air filter box and uh, so for that we'll have to remove the battery and uh, we can hopefully get it to it from 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 this angle from here here is the transmission sensor we got this from eBay for 33 pounds just gonna get it out of the box just to show you how it looks There we go. So that is the transmission sensor. It's uh, secured by one 10 mil volt. In order to get to it, we'll have to remove the battery. So we're just gonna undo the positive and negative terminals. There we go. And then the negative one. There we go, that's the positive and negative terminal of the battery. There we go. Just gonna pull out the battery. right friends here is the transmission speed sensor just there and it's secured by one 10 mil bolt so we're just gonna undo the connector first and then uh, we're gonna remove that bolt in order to change the sensor so we're gonna press this clip and pull out the harness connector Right, so just gonna undo this uh, 10 mil bolt. There we go. That's the 10 mil bolt out of the way. We're just gonna wiggle it. To pull it out of the slot there you go so here is the old transmission sensor right, so we're just gonna get the new one out of the packaging There we go, friends. So it's a it's a like for like, exactly same as the old one. So we're gonna insert that in. There we go. Gonna push it all the way in. Here comes the bolt. gonna torque it up there you go friends that's the 
sensor itself nicely screwed. Just going to screw the connector. Here the clip. Here we go, friends. That's the harness connector nicely screwed. So we're just going to put the battery back on. Here comes the battery, battery box. Just gonna secure the clamp. Right, here we go. Just gonna tighten this clamp here. Right, here we go, friends. Uh, job done. So we tested the car and it's uh, it's going in D mode nicely and uh, it's moving uh, forward and reverse nicely as well just going to demonstrate it to you here we go friends so we're gonna put it in reverse and we're gonna move the car back yeah it's it's moving nicely you can see it yeah so now we're gonna put it in drive here we go friends yeah it's running nicely so the problem is sorted I hope uh, this video helps you sorting out your issue with your Hondas. Thank you very much for watching the video.